Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit the like button, y'all. Subscribe, man. Show some love. So anyway, Zion Williamson, and I meant to make a video about this, but I, I had read and seen several different reports that his contract now is pretty much like a football contract to where the last three years of his contract is not guaranteed. Zion has missed most, at least, at least half his career injuries or whatever be going on with him. So the Pelicans had a clause in his contract about his weight and just about, I guess, if he missed so many different games, the contract's no longer guaranteed. And my thing is kudos to the Pelicans. Shout out to y'all. Was that Miss Benson on the team? You did y'all did a great thing giving him a football contract because I'm still a believer, and and, and he somebody got to prove me wrong that Ja I mean Ja that Zion ain't really taking basketball that serious, and you know there's no excuse for that. You're a multi. You're making over $40, $50 million a year in endorsements and everything. And you come to work overweight, right? And again, us common people, right? The regulars like us, we can, we, we supposed to be in, in pretty decent shape too just for our health. But we're not getting paid millions of dollars to be in shape. And I get how Zion is. I'm like that too where, you know, me and my homeboy, we can go grab some, some something to eat. And they be fine. And by the time I put my fork down, I didn't gain 10 pounds and we didn't eat the same thing. So I get it. It sucks. Everybody's body types is different, right? Zion, you clearly put on weight fast. And you're going to have to get a uh, round the clock team of chefs or whatever to make sure that you eat the proper food for your body. And I get it, you in New Orleans, man. New Orleans got some good food, y'all. Y'all ain't never been there. Go check it out. It's several good things about New Orleans. Some I can't say on, on, on YouTube. But, uh, you know, the food is, is off the chain. However, man, again, you're making millions upon millions upon millions, man. And I seen Gilbert Arenas say, kind of talk about this. Zion, you might be hitting LeBron up. LeBron has been has always been in shape. He spends a lot of money on his body. He works with a, a team off season. When the season is over, um, he immediately goes back to work. Zion and I know this was what last year, year before, you sitting around in the Mountain Dew commercial, just completely overweight. And I just, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't excuse it for for athletes. And I had people last time. Getting on me about that. No, man, these, this dude is, this is his job. His job is to be in phenomenal shape to stay healthy and explosive for the, so the people on TV and the people in the seats can enjoy, enjoy an hour of uh, basketball play. But no, I mean, you know, we try to make excuses for this guy. And, you know, he ain't 18 years old. Ja got to, I mean, I keep saying Ja. Zion got to be at least 22, 23. Like, we get it, you young, but when you sign that contract, you know what's up. So, no, I don't feel bad for him, you know. And, and, and while I am for the NFL players getting money and get, having all their money guaranteed, I see why the owners is basically saying not for my cold deceased hands because this is what happens when the inmates run the asylum. You got people like Kevin Durant who unhappy in Phoenix, even though you pretty much forced your way there. Uh, James Harden forces himself off every team. You got Zion who signed that mega deal and then immediately got right back out of shape. So I don't have a problem with with owner saying, no, nah, man, we ain't finna pay you for this, man. Think about us, right? If, if 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 I don't create content or if I don't show up to work or have to do my job, I can't expect for them to pay me. So, my bad, y'all had to get some water. I'm thirsty after being on that treadmill for an hour. 
Um, so yeah, I don't know. He he gonna have to. Zion gonna have to man. He gonna have to do some real thinking and figure out what he want to do because you can't do both. You know, you can't eat Twinkies and 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 little Debbie cakes and all of that. And you have going to work, but then you want them to pay you $45, $50 million a year. But anyway, I don't want to get my quick two cents on it. Tell me what y'all think.